I'm trying to show my buffalo. What? There's a hole in my buffalo. <laughs> what buffalo? <laughs> There's something in my buffalo. Oh, uh, there are there people you. right there, that white thing on the ground. They're not. This is. Mm -hmm. Do you need to help them out from under the bed? <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay, so there was this thing under the bed, <laughs> and I didn't know what it was. And, uh, um, I thought it was like a shoe or something. And I thought it was someone's shoe, so I was like, oh my god, there's someone trapped under the bed. I need to help them out. <laughs> but there is no under the bed, because, like, there isn't an under the bed. <laughs> There is a shoe stuck under it or something, so I'm like, oh my god, there's someone stuck under my bed, I need to help them out. She thought their shoe was sticking so out? I, I took it out, and it was like this little thing I used to put my iPod in. <laughs> and then Jan asked me, she's like, how did they get under the bed then? And then I'm like, they could turn into a cat, and you know how they go under the doors? They could have done that. I don't think they could have done that as I do. It's like there isn't even this like much space like there. a little kitty or something. Oh, I don't. What? If, I think a lizard would be able to fit into well, there. Oh, they didn't turn into a gecko. They turned into a cat. Are Are you sure? Yeah. He's a cat. Yeah. <laughs> and then I have like twenty nine, like hand sanitizer bottles in here. Where? Well, there's like one of my cars and there's one there and there's one there. one on the windowsill up there. Oh no, I heard there's one over there. there so no one can find them and then like, put germs in them or something. Pleasure, I think that you're a hypochondriac <laughs> and a germaphobe. <laughs> <thing. laughs> and, and you're a little paranoid. Like one time I learned about hepatitis and how it makes your eyes turn yellow. So like, and I went swimming that day so I couldn't see very well. And like, I thought my eyes were yellow. I'm like, oh my gosh, mom, do I have hepatitis? <laughs> so like, when I learn symptoms of a disease, I think I have them. Hypochondriac. That's not something to be proud I'm of. Not proud. I hate it. Mm -hmm. Mom's like, Sasha, you're gonna get an ulcer in your stomach. I'm like, yes, that makes me feel better. <laughs> oh my god, now my stomach hurts, mom. Why'd you say that? <laughs> and then today. I was bleeding, and someone's like, oh, Sasha, you're bleeding, and I thought they touched it, and I was like, don't touch me. <laughs> you could put, like, a germ or something in my blood. <laughs> Sometimes. Oh. Yeah, I forgot what I Oh, yeah, I remember we were watching a zombie movie once, and there was this guy with yellow eyes, and she's like, oh, my God, he has hepatitis. Don't let him touch me. It's really funny. Oh yeah, and then when my mom puts the gas in the car, I always make her check to make sure there's not a needle, because that happened before, like, someone put, like, AIDS on this needle, and put it on the gas thing, and then people would, like, get poked by it, and get AIDS, and I was like, mom, you always have to check. Yes, please, always check for AIDS. And needles. Darn straight. That's the moral of you know what? our stories. Yeah. Un tala. Check for AIDS. Don't say that. I don't like AIDS. <laughs> just, just do it, okay? Mm.